Hey friends, how is it going? In this video, we are going to talk about how this airport will change into this one. The question comes from Cambridge 16. First of all, we are going to identify 10 changes which will be made to this airport and then we write an introduction, an overview and two body paragraphs. So let's dive in. All right, so let's uh, compare these two airports. Um, you can pause the video to identify the changes. But if we look at the two airports, we can see clear differences that the main one is the number of gates, okay? So we see the number of gates will increase and we have a new Y-shaped area, all right? And another change is the SkyTrain will be replaced, uh, will replace a walkway. So instead of the, the walkway, we will have a, a new SkyTrain. Another thing is that there will be some shops between the security and gates. You see this change as well. And uh, the departure check-in will be moved. So you see the check-in will be relocated. Um, the de departure backdrop will be added. So this is something new in the new uh, airport. Uh, the departure uh, cafe will be added uh, so you see this one it's something new uh, arrival cafe will be added also uh, the arrival ATM will be added and there will be a new car hire office you can also talk about the extended area and you see there will be extra doors compared to the previous map so all in all, we identified uh, 10 different changes, so it's time to write uh, our report. First of all, in the introduction, we should simply paraphrase the, um, paraphrase the question into the overview. The diagram shows, instead of the plan below shows, we say the diagram shows the site of the airport. Now, we, we write about the current layout, the southwest airport, we write the name and how will how it will look after redevelopment say a proposed new design for the airport development for the overview uh, plan to write two sentences it's not a rule but we suggest that so we say it's clear that the airport will undergo significant redevelopment why well, it's not that clear we should add some more details and 10 changes will be made in total. The most noticeable differences is uh, that we see on the proposed plan is the addition of a new Y-shaped building to accommodate more gates. We see that so it's one of the major changes. Mm -hmm. Then in, for uh, writing two-body paragraphs, it's a good idea to first of all write about the northern parts, I mean the gates, the shops uh, uh, in the first body paragraphs and write about the departure area and arrival areas in the second body paragraphs. So first of all, let's have a look at the first body paragraphs. In the body paragraphs, we should give more details. Looking at the diagrams more closely, we see that the redeveloped airport will have 18 gates, you see the details, rather than the current eight. In the new larger building, the walkway that takes passengers to and from their gates will be replaced by a SCAR train. The departure side of the airport will also benefit from the addition of shops between the security area and the gates. And in the second body paragraph, we can write about the other changes. There are also a number of replacements and new features in the arrival in and departure areas. I prefer to write a kind of topic sentence for the second paragraph. In the departure section, the existing cafe and check-in will be relocated to the lower uh, left corner and the right side, and a new backdrop is planned to be added on the left. In the arrival section, there will be another cafe and, AT and an ATM, as well as a car, car hire office. It's better to write office here because a car hire cannot be very clear. A car hire office in an extended area in the lower right corner. Passengers will also benefit from some extra doors for departures and arrival. Okay, uh, feel free to write down your comments and tell me how you would write uh, this report. 
and I hope to see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye.